Hello everyone, my name is Anna Südkamp. I would like to invite you to my keynote presentation at the early 2015 conference in Limassol, Cyprus. Together with Johanna Kaiser and Jens Möller, I have been awarded the early 2013 Outstanding Publication Award, which comes along with the honor of giving a keynote presentation at the next early conference. Currently, I'm a postdoctoral research fellow at the Faculty of Rehabilitation Sciences at TU Dortmund University. Dortmund is located in the western part of Germany. It is a former city of coal and steel, which is still visible today. The people of Dortmund are united by their enthusiasm for soccer. At TU Dortmund University, I'm involved in TTI education. I give lectures on educational and psychological testing for teachers. In my courses, I also address how to promote students' learning individually in heterogeneous classrooms. From my point of view, both of these issues are of increasing importance, especially against the background of inclusion. At the Department of Rehabilitation Psychology, which is led by Heinrich Tröster, our team currently has a strong focus on this issue. My research interests include peer relations and school adjustment, strategies for the assessment of students with special educational needs, and teachers' assessment competencies, especially teacher judgment accuracy. I have prepared this talk together with Johanna Kaiser, who works at the Department of Educational Psychology at the University of Kiel in Germany, and Jens Möller, who is the chair of this department. I thank both of them for their support and for giving me credit for giving this keynote presentation. What can you expect from my talk? First, I will introduce our model of teacher judgment accuracy, which is a framework for our research in this area. Second, I will present the results of our meta-analysis on the accuracy of teachers' judgments of students' academic achievement. Third, I will give a review of current research on teacher judgment accuracy that goes beyond the issue of the meta-analysis. Here, I will draw your attention to field studies as well as to experimental studies. For our own experimental studies, we have developed innovative tools to study teacher judgment accuracy. One of them is the simulated classroom, which is a computer simulation of an instructional situation. Here, different factors can be experimentally manipulated. For example, students' achievement and engagement, students' gender, as indicated by a photograph or name, or the size of the class. In the simulated classroom, the participant takes over the role of a teacher, interacting with simulated students. In doing so, he addresses uh, questions to the students and observes their responses. Later, the participant assesses students' academic achievement. Based on the data, we are able to evaluate whether teachers' judgments are accurate. We also study which factors influence teacher judgment accuracy. In one study, we investigated whether students' ethnicity influences teacher judgment accuracy. We found that students of the ethnic minority in the class were judged more accurately than students of the ethnic majority in the class. In my talk, I will report on more interesting results. Finally, I will outline directions for future research and I will also discuss practical implications. Well, I hope you enjoyed this short video. I am very much looking forward to the early 2015 conference and to seeing you all in Limassol.